Tanesky found common ground between murders in 2005 and 2007 and wrote articles about possible serial murders. Both victims were damaged naked and wrapped in plastic bags tied to strings. Traces of sexual assault and body fluids believed to belong to the suspect were detected. Tanesky, who wrote the scoop, suddenly became a hot topic and the public criticized the incompetent police. While the police were scrambling, Tanesky took a step ahead by publishing an interview with the victim's sister. However, a third murder case occurred as if mocking the police. It was the same method again this time. Tanesky ran a detailed article about the telephone line. The police had doubts because they had never given him information about the telephone line. The police discovered that Tanesky had written the article vividly as if he had seen the scene and suspected it and began to investigate Tanesky. Tracing Tanesky found that Tanesky had purchased a large number of telephone lines several years ago and that the body fluid detected in the victim's body matched Tanesky's DNA. Arrested by police, Tanesky was a journalist capable enough to win Macedonia's Best Journalist Award, but he has been in a long slump since the 2000s, and blind to success, he has committed a series of murders himself and used it as a scoop. Tanesky ended his life by committing suicide in prison a day after his imprisonment.